Buenos dias. Uh, buenos dias. This is let's bring questions to. Oh my love. Yes. She's a big. She's a big fan. Another new internet cat thing. Yeah, well, she's a very big fan of Dream. She's a little bit shy. She 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 said earlier she wanted to get your autograph, but um, my she was. Autograph. Yeah, my autograph. Yeah, autograph. If you just, if you just put some food in her bowl, she'll love you no, forever. That's, that's the stuff. Anyway, we're, we're at Casa Flamingo. It is, I'm here in, in my, my, my glamorous palatial villa here in Ibiza with the dead flamingo on the um, lilo back there sunning itself. And I have, of course, the international rock star that he is, Peter Kuna, here in my house. The <laughs> lead singer of d -Ream, who of course is well known for his hits, uh, Things Can Only Get Better, and You're the Best Thing, and many others. And the amazing thing is, of course, Peter's not just here because I'm another rock star. Uh, it's because he's here because he's my friend. And he is married to a very, very dear friend of mine. And he has just done a gig here in Ibiza at the 80s, 90s festival at Ibiza Rocks. That's right. How yeah. was that? It was incredible. I um, think the, um, the audience... Uh, I was there. I know how good it was. <laughs> no, no. It was, they were great. They were great. I mean, considering the Thomas Cook thing had put everyone out. Yeah. And some people couldn't make it over and lost holidays and stuff. It was good. The audience really good. The, the audience was amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I have to say, you know, because I was there for quite a bit of it. And yeah. you, when you came on, it was like, yeah. well, to be fair, you kind of filled the place and then it... It was yeah. lo lovely. And it's, uh, no disrespect it's interesting to gigging in the heat. <laughs> You're talking to me? That's just come from <laughs> Dubai. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't talk to me about heat. 55 degrees in Dubai. That's not good. No, no, no. That, that's not even human. But uh, haven't they got enough manpower to just, like, have people... Fanning you as you they had big fans, yeah. but they needed to have air conditioning the entire beach. You know, right. that's, that's hard to do. It's a little hard. I mean, well, they could probably do it if anybody could do yeah, it. Yeah, that's true. Actually, you've got enough money. Yeah, yeah there's but money uh, everything, they? they didn't bother. <laughs> so I had heat stroke, but anyway, I survived. And and I'm here to say that uh, in literally a few weeks' time, I'll be releasing my own very ver uh, special version, very uh, very yeah. different version of yeah. Things Can Only Get Better. And the reason I wanted to do this song was not just because uh, Peter's a friend of mine and, um, and so it's personal, but uh, because this song, a lot of people think, I think, it's a, I think a lot of people think it's a love song. I think they, a lot of people don't listen to the lyrics. And yeah. because you say, you know, now that I found you, they think mm -hmm. it's like, you know, singing to your girlfriend, your boyfriend. Right. But this is a love song to the world, right? It's a, it's a love song. It's what you want to make it, Chris, you know? I never it's what you want to make thought it. about it that way, but yeah. Well, you know, to me, it's like I, I read, when I actually read the lyrics, I was like, okay, mm. this is actually a song saying, well, we collectively, mm -hmm. you know, mm. when we when we walk each other's paths, when we wear each other's shoes, when we, you know, understand each other's it's a good interpretation, you know, problems, and, and we try to connect, we we we, we, we get better, right? Yeah. And yeah. there's probably no better time than right now to give the world that message. So. A little bit of positivity is yeah. going to go a long way. So it, I think you've done a great, great job, I must say. I, I heard your version and, uh, no, <laughs> wonderful. Because I've always, I've always said to people, you've got the kind of singing voice that I can only dream of. And uh, it's wonderful to hear it sung Aww. so beautifully. But also, I think, in a way, with the treatment you've given it, the lyrics are, are shining a bit better and you're, you've really taken ownership of it. Now, it's very rare that I get to hear something that I think is as good as, if not better in its own way than the original. There's very few examples of that, but this one, honestly, I can only wish you the, I can honestly only wish you the best with it, mate. I know how tough it is what with this world. What a beautiful thing to say. No, seriously, seriously you know, I, 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 Well, it's a tough old business, we know that. Oh, uh, yeah, it's yeah. Yeah, music business is tough, but, and uh, but you've got it sounding right for the American market, and, and I think they're gonna they're gonna hear you, they're gonna hear that, and you know I can only wish you the best with it, mate. Well, we've stripped it, we've stripped it yeah, right back, to, yeah. so that you really do hear the lyrics, mm. uh, which are amazing, and um, and we have quite a few remixes coming up, but yeah, yeah, but to have, uh, yeah. of course, whenever you cover a track, most of the time you don't have the luxury of actually knowing the original artist, but if you do get any uh, feedback from the original artist. No, it's it's always a relief to know that it's positive, but to hear that and from you. And who is it? Uh, Eric Copper? Who's the remix? Eric Copper is one of the remixes. That's uh, brilliant. That's, yeah, I think that's well, my favorite. Well, I know he, you, he is a legend. Yeah, absolutely. And he worked with Morales. Did he? Copper, Copper's worked with yeah, yeah, everybody. Yeah. I, I, wrote I wrote with Dave. I wrote with Dave. I did you? I went to New York and okay. worked with him there. I actually went to his house and helped him paint it when he moved in. 
<laughs> David Morales. Yeah. Did you? Yeah, we were good buddies wow. for a while. Yeah, I stayed in New York for about three months with him. Oh, that's yeah. very well, that's yeah. very cool. I mean, yeah. it, Cupper was doing um, a lot of uh, Frankie Knuckles production. Um, right. Worked oh, with Frankie Knuckles we're for not many, worthy. many years. We are not worthy. Well, well, you know, I am because <laughs> I worked with Frankie Knuckles. But yeah, but, but <laughs> uh, you are worthy, and I'm not. Well, yeah. There you go. I never really felt <laughs> like that. Now was, we're clear. But, yeah. <laughs> but according to Google, you can actually find our names together, which is very exciting. Oh, I love that. Love that. No, but we are we are excited about this release. I'm very very thrilled to have uh, Peter here, and I went to see him yesterday. Uh, it was great to see him for the first time singing that song live. Yeah. Um, and uh, today I'm releasing the artwork for the very first time, so it's quite a nice uh, coincidence that you're here. Yeah. And uh, and we're here having coffee in this beautiful morning oh, yes. in Ibiza. We've had 12 hours of sleep. We've been to yoga, did some meditation this That's morning, right, yeah. and a little bit of charity work. <laughs> and um, yeah, we're about to all, run. A, we're about to. Lunch. We're about to run a marathon, yeah. and it's only 10 a.m. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. That's how we roll in Ibiza. Yeah. That's Ibiza 2019. Yeah. Rock and roll is very over. different to 97. <laughs> yeah. Things have changed here now. It's, yeah. it's all. I mean, they've got sound limiters everywhere, which is very, very disappointing. It's all got very grown up and boring. It's, well, it's I, this isn't grown up. This is just stupid. <laughs> It's yeah. Ibiza, yeah. you have uh, all these, uh, yeah. don't get me started, don't, no, don't no, get me started. Get started no, As a yeah. vocalist with the, uh, <laughs> yeah. the sound regulations, it's, it's, it's yeah. gone crazy, don't it's gone the wrong way here. Yeah. It's the wrong way, but whatever. Luckily, there's a whole big world out there that I can perform in, yeah. and, uh, and I'm going to be rocking your song, and I'm going to be doing everything I can to make sure that where, I do it justice. Where are you going to be playing next? Have you got anything lined up? I am playing all over the world. All over the world. <laughs> all over the world. No, I will, I, will be, I will be posting my international dates very soon. Great. great. But yeah, but uh, for now, from Ibiza, with Peter Kuna, the lead singer and writer. Chris Mayda. Payton, everybody. Chris Payton. Just, my man. Just Payton, just Payton. Isn't that American you say, my man? It's like In Ireland, we say, my man. Things can only get better until they get worse. <laughs>